In this video, I'm going to focus on the hinge and gear mate, starting with the hinge. The hinge mate does exactly what it sounds like, simulate the movement of a hinge. To use the mate, select mates, mechanical mates and hinge. First, select the two entries that is to be concentric. Next, select two coincident entries. And finally, you can optionally select a limitation in the angle of the hinge. Press OK and see the result. The gear mate is used to, sim used to simulate movement between two gears. The movement will be relative to the ratio that you can decide. First, select the gear mate in the mechanical mates. Next, select the two components that you want to move. They must contain an axis. The software decides the ratio of movement based on the size of the two components. This value can be overwritten if you want to. In this example, I will set the ratio to 1 to 4. For every turn the second component makes, the first component turns 4 times. Press OK to see the result. In the next video, I will look into the rack pinion mate and the screw mate.